Chapter 5 Greenland, the Land of Snow Get set. Find and write the names of at least four countries falling in the frigid zone. The polar regions are the coldest regions of the earth and are generally covered with ice and snow. When we talk about the climatic zone for these places, these places fall in the frigid zones. They are located around the North Pole and the South Pole. Alaska, Canada, Greenland, Norway and Russia are in the Arctic northern region. Antarctica is the southern region. Polar regions have extremely cold temperatures. The regions are far away from the equator. They get less direct sunlight than other areas. Some or all of the land is covered with permanent ice. The hours of daylight are also extreme. In this chapter, we shall study about Greenland, the land of snow, to know more about the frigid zone. Greenland Location Greenland situated in the North Atlantic Ocean, northeast of Canada. It is the largest island in the world and is located in the continent of North America. It stands third in terms of area in North American countries. Its boundaries are just 650 kilometers away from the North Pole. It is an autonomous province of Denmark. Its total area is about 21,75,600 square kilometer. The northernmost point in the world, Cape Boris, Jesup, is located in this island. Climate 80% of the Greenland island is covered with ice. Along the north central coast, the climate is Arctic meaning that the summer temperatures hover around 0 degrees Celsius. The climate is a little milder, subarctic, towards the south. In Nuuk, the most populated city located in the south, the summers are cold and the winters are freezing, snowy, windy and overcast. The temperature in the city varies between minus 11 degrees Celsius to 10 degrees Celsius and rarely goes below minus 18 degrees Celsius or above 12 degrees Celsius. Eyes in Greenland Walrus Polar bear Because humidity is low and Greenland is one of the best countries in the world for air quality, visibility is excellent. Even far off mountains look much closer than they are. And since the air is so dry, it doesn't feel as cold as one might expect. Relief Features Greenland features unique and dramatic scenery, including the highest portions of the Northern Hemisphere's largest ice cap as well as the northernmost area of land on the Earth. One of Greenland's most prominent geographic features is its massive ice sheet, which covers more than 80% of the country. The Jakob Schavan Glacier is a large valley glacier in West Greenland. It moves about 100 feet a day, making it one of the fastest moving glaciers in the world. The Jakob Schavan drains 6.5% of the Greenland ice sheet and produces about 10% of all the country's icebergs. Icebergs are the large pieces of massive ice sheets, which often broke off and slide into the sea. Only a small tip of an iceberg is visible above water. The remaining part remains underwater. They are very dangerous for the ships. The remaining ice-free land consists of the island's coastal regions and is made primarily of highlands. Mountain chains run along the country's east and west coast, with the highest point reaching 12,139 feet, that is 3,700 meters, at Gumb Jorn, mountain in the southeast. Chirpy says, if the entire Greenland ice sheets were melted, it would raise sea level by nearly 23 feet, that is, 7 meters. Flora and Fauna In the name of vegetation, nothing grows in the ice-covered areas of Greenland. There are no forests and no crops can be grown here. In summers, when there is little relief from cold, some mosses, lichens, shrubs and grasses grow here. Besides some colorful flowers, blueberries and cranberries can also be spotted here. Despite lack of natural vegetation, Greenland is home to many species of mammals and birds, including polar bear, reindeer, also called caribou, muskoxen, arctic foxes, eagles, ptarmigans, hares, lemmings, 
and Arctic wolves. There are approximately 235 different species of birds in Greenland. Most of these are migratory. Some of more common types include Arctic terns, white-tailed eagles, northern fulmars, black gullimots, common eaters, and rock ptarmigans. The Arctic waters surrounding Greenland abound in whales, including the narwhal, humpback, spawn, pilot, blue, minke, beluga, and fin whales. Seals are also extremely common with a population of around 80 lakh. Walruses are often seen on the northern and eastern coast. The Greenland polar bears hunts seals in birds from the sea, ice year-round, and sometimes comes on shore to consume vegetation in the summer. The bears usually do not hibernate during winter. Due to the high numbers of Arctic animals living here, whereas Inuit cultures have survived in this frigid climate for thousands of years. Lifestyle Greenland is one of three constituents of the Kingdom of Denmark and is an autonomous division of the kingdom with limited self-government and its own parliament and prime minister. About one-third of the island's population lives in Nuuk, the largest city and the capital. Around 12% of Greenland's population is Danish and 88% is Inuit, Eskimos, the area's indigenous people. Most of them have now merged with the Europeans and are called Greenlanders. They are short and strong and have a yellowish-brown skin. They have high cheekbones and narrow black eyes. Living in groups, they lead a primitive life. Their clothes are made from animal skins, which are common for all men, women and children. They wear a hooded jacket called parka with a pair of double trousers and high boots. They love to decorate their clothes with beads, fur and animal parts like toenails. The winter season is the challenging time for the Eskimos. They display their art of building igloos. An igloo is made of blocks of ice cemented together with snow. Presently, they also build their houses using stone, wood and animal skin. They use whale rib bones and grass to make the roof. Such houses are known as sod houses. In summer, the Eskimos live in skin tents called two pigs. Fishing and hunting are the chief occupations of the Eskimos. They are expert hunters who hunt whales, musk oxen, walruses and polar bears. To hunt a seal, they dig a hole in the ice and wait nearby for a seal to come around. A harpoon is their main hunting weapon. It is a spear with a rope attached to it. Now, rifles have mostly replaced harpoons. People speak Greenlandic and Danish. Most people can speak both languages. There is a tradition of singing and art in Greenland. Some popular music bands are also working there. The popular sports there include football, track and field, handball and skiing. Think a while. A person who can speak two languages is called a bilingual. Occupations and Industries Fishing is the main occupation of Greenlanders. Fish processing is a major source of employment. Almost every third Greenlander is employed in it. People catch fish for export. This is canned, frozen or salted before export. The important varieties of fish found here include cod, halibut, salmon, shrimp and wolf fish. In summer months, people are also engaged in sheep rearing and vegetation farming. Shipbuilding is another major industry of Greenland. Greenland also has abundant minerals like iron, uranium, aluminium, nickel, etc. So mining is gradually expanding here. Transport The Eskimos use boat and sledge as means of transport. They make two types of boats. Small boats, called kayaks, are made with the skin of sea animals. The bigger boats, called umiaks, are used in fishing. A sledge is very popular which is pulled by a group of reindeer or huskies. Now, motorized boats and sledges are being used commonly. Greenland is also connected with cities of North America and Europe by air. Development 
science and technology have helped to improve the quality of life in Greenland. They now have access to electricity supply. Schools, hospitals and clubs can be seen around. Compulsory education has been introduced for children up to the age of 14 years. Motor boats have mostly replaced boats for fishing. Some industrial units have been set up which deal in fur, mining and oil drilling. Electricity is produced mainly from water. Important cities Gothub, also known as Nuuk, is the capital and largest city of Greenland. Almost one-third population of Greenland lives in this city. It is connected to Iceland by air. Now it is planning to have air connectivity to Europe and America. It has an important harbour which remains ice-free around the year. There is shipping service to Denmark from here. Sisimuth, formerly known as Holesteinburg, is the second largest city in Greenland. It is a port town with a large shipyard. It is an important fishing and industrial town of Greenland. Quick Review The polar regions located around the North Pole and South Pole are the coldest regions of the Earth. Greenland is the largest island in the world sitting in the North Atlantic Ocean. Greenland is one of the best countries in the world for air quality. The Jacob Chauvin drains 6.5% of the Greenland ice sheet and produces about 10% of all the country's icebergs. There are approximately 235 different species of birds in Greenland. About one-third of the island's population lives in Nuuk, the largest city and the capital. Around 12% of Greenland's population is Danish and 88% is Inuit, Eskimos. Fishing is the main occupation of Greenlanders. Small boats, called kayaks, are made with the skin of sea animals. Gothub, also known as Nuuk, is the capital and largest city of Greenland.